Hello, welcome back. <clears throat> We're back. Where did we leave off yesterday? We left off yesterday um, after exploring the main street of Rosewood. We uh, we went to the grocery store. We went to uh, the bookstore. Found some books. We visited the apartments above the bookstore. They're still looking. We didn't go to the barber shop. We didn't go to the fashion um, store. And uh, we didn't go into the church, but we were just outside of the uh, the church. We went, uh, we dipped into one of the little neighborhoods um, and uh, almost got bitten. And uh, we're on the search for a generator and a book to teach us how to use the generator. I think with enough, uh, with enough skill ups in electricity, we can learn how to use generators as well. So, I mean, if we can't find the book, there could be another way, but we'll see. Uh, so it's pitch black, it's noon, and uh, we're, back, uh, we're back at home with uh, some stuff uh, to drop off, I believe. We picked up some stuff. There is some stuff in the car as well. We got some spare boots. Do I have any other military boots? Is that my only one? My only spare pair. Okay, it's good to have uh, it's good to have a spare, right? Woodcraft episode four. We picked up two. We still don't have a um, VCR though. We need a, a better TV. We can pick one up while we're out. See if uh, we can load it into the van, right? Would be good. All right, let's drop off some of this stuff. We've got a uh, meat cleaver. Oh, I picked up this roasting pan as well, which could be useful for uh, making some succulent meals. You never know. Beef jerky, chocolate, flour, ketchup, marinara, and sugar. The beef jerky and chocolate we just take with us, I guess, right? Scissors, twine, and then, yes, all these books that we don't really need to carry around with us we'll come back here and read them right we'll need to read them uh when we have uh, some light we might have to go outside and read them the metalwork magazine has not been read let me read that right now knowledge is power yeah am i carrying yeast good good you're right, I am. Trapping Volume 1 can go in here too. Um, and this is done. Alright, let me go deposit this yeast in the yeast receptacle, which is of course under the sink here. We got some cotton balls now too. We should probably look into doing some uh, tailoring soon, right? Because uh, let me just check on some of my gear to see the state of it. Some of this stuff could probably do with being repaired, right? Dust mask is good. Holster is good. These gloves are still in good condition, actually. Riding helmet's in good condition. Large backpack is fine. This McCoy's t-shirt's still fine. Military boots condition? Eh, almost half. I don't know if there's anything that we, we can really do to them, to fix them. Bulletproof vest, missing a little bit. Same with the jacket. Trousers are fine. Um, shirt, missing a little bit. My underpants and bra are fine. Got some dirty socks here. Um, and the wood axe, the condition of the wood axe is starting to, uh, is starting to drop a little bit. But we have a hand axe, I believe. Oh, that's a bit dangerous, actually. Not having the vision outside. You're just opening the door and hoping that there's nothing out here. Scary. Scary. Um, there's a shotgun, some imitation flamingos, a couple of planks left as well. What do I have in here? All sorts of stuff. We got a rifle, some planks. Where is that other axe? 
I definitely, oh, it's here. It's a hand axe in, uh, in decent condition, actually. So we'll put this on um, belt right. Perfect. And we got the nightstick as a backup too, right? Okay, lug wrench, rifle, empty gas cans, filled gas cans, radio receivers and stuff that we can take apart. I mean, we can leave all this stuff in the truck for now. It's probably fine. There's so there's enough space in the truck too. I think we want to go and hit some of these um, other spots, right? <laughs> couple of a uh, couple of attempts there, <laughs> no problem. Oh, okay. I've got some chocolate and stuff. Oh, hello. We got some we got some nasty ones here. Let me eat this chocolate. Got a couple of couple of nasty so and so's here. Anything? No. All right. I'm a hand axe. That's not nice. That's not really a nice thing to say, actually. Okay. Good, 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 good. We didn't find keys to uh, either of these cars, right? We might have to tow them eventually. Um, we didn't really start disassembling too much uh, in the uh, in the hotel yet, right? TV we don't need to really worry about for now because, um, well... Oh, there's a van back here, isn't there? At the loading bay? We can check. See if there's anything else over here. I'm sure I've checked these other cars, though. Oh. Take out the trash a little bit here. It'd be good to clear this area. Oh gosh, we're getting tired already. I think for this we could take some vitamins, right? Give ourselves a little bit of energy. I want to be careful by these trees just in case there's anyone back here. Give ourselves enough space and some vision. Ooh. A hunting knife. Hunting knife, we can strip uh, twigs and stuff, right? Off of... Uh, Trees. Panicking. Slight panic. Feeling a little tired as well. Melon nose. Is it a pen? Nothing here really. Sneakers. I think I opened these doors back here so we can uh, get into. Wow, oh, shit. We're a little bit tired to take all these guys on. We can try though take some more vitamins just for now Kentucky baseball cap.
just want to have a quick look in here. There's a hard hat here. Twine, turquoise paint, screwdriver. Looks like it's like a painter's van. Don't want to get trapped in this car. Ugh. head back in a sec. Let's just see if there's a key in here. Yeah. There is. Some safety goggles. A CD. Bandage. Annotated map. Alright. No fuel. I got a hard hat on now. Look. Look at me. A proper construction worker. Struggling a little. Was there candy in the van? Oh, I didn't check actually. Was it a white van? I'm driving a white van. Should I load up this van with some candy? Might be good. Satin negligee. Mm. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? What's he doing here? All right. Still uh, light out for a bit, so we can maybe try to read for a bit before we go to bed. Anybody in here? All right, what are we reading? Carpentry Volume 4, Mechanics Volume 1. This one's been uh, read already. Mechanics Volume 2, can't read it. Metalwork Volume 1. Okay. It might be too dark in here, actually. Let's see. No, it's fine. We'll make a start on it. Get nice and tired. Go to bed a little bit later so that we don't wake up too early. We're very tired now. this cheese before it goes bad. I'm going to put these fries on the ground as well. Uh, twine, hammer, hand axe, Hard hat. 
What am I wearing right now? Riding helmet. Has no insulation. It has a hundred bite and scratch defense. This one does too. Insulation, wind resistance, and water resistance. All right. Let's go to bed. We'll have a nice morning smoke, yes? Hopefully we don't get attacked in the middle of the night. It's not a very secure place, I realize, but... We are trying to keep it clear, at least. Louisville. Very dark. Very dark. How's this water bottle doing? We got two bottles here. One's uh, nearly empty and the other one's full. Okay, perfect. Which one has the uh, other stuff in it? It's the far one. Okay, let's chew some gum. Hmm, nice. Can you can you plant sunflower seeds? You must be able to, right? Or are these ones just for eating? Can you only eat those ones? Louisville. All that stuff in the freezer is going to go bad soon, isn't it? Annoyingly. All right, empty cooking pot. Let's get you placed out here in my very unsecure front yard. All right. Let's go see if we can actually um, get into uh, the, uh, the area with the houses. See if we can find anything decent. I mean, we'll grab a we'll grab a TV. We got space for it, so we'll grab the TV uh, from there once we start clearing it out a little bit. Um, I think we're good for. There's the Rosewood Country Buffet and fas Fashionable Fashionable. We haven't been into the medical place. We haven't been into haircuts and more or legal services. We checked out the uh, the corner store here briefly. Haven't been in the church. Haven't looked at any of these cars. We're gonna start make a start on some of these houses, which we've done a couple. on bow tie. Incredible. Oh my god, the double. You love to see it. ask you to step away from the vehicle. Oh, 
Hello. through that. There's two of them, so they'll be through it in a minute. Hello. No, oh, Jesus. I could be dead, actually. Bitten. <laughs> We're dead. Oh, I can't believe he bit my groin. Oh, man, that's so unlucky. I mean, there's a chance, right? Or do you think it's it? Do you think we're just dead? You think it's all over? I think we're done. We're we're limping. Did I check? Oh, I this the setting is is bitten is a hundred percent. You're you're off. You're dead. Let's have one last smoke. Oh man, what a great run too. What a great run that was. You can just start a new character on the same map. I don't really want to start on the map with everything. Well, I think we just we just do what we've been doing. What a what an unfortunate way to go. I mean, it, like, how many zombies did we kill with this guy? Three hundred and seventy-five. Just to get randomly bitten in the groin. I know we were doing so well. <laughs> it just shows it turns so quickly. That's life. Yeah, you're right. It is. We just wanted a generator. Well, this one's a safe house, too. So there's guys in here, but guns and this is the third safe house we found right bitten and bleeding Or something? No. I guess not every garage has a window. This nice barbecue, too. Oh, good night, big Howard. <laughs> Your dick let you down for the last time. Poor Howard, he tried, he did try. 
I don't think we can cut our groin off, sadly. If only we could just carve our groin off. see him on the radar there at all. Jesus. It's a garden saw here. There's a machete and a sledgehammer. Oh, man. <laughs> we needed these things, and now we can't use them. Well, every time we we die, we learn more, right? And we just got to we just got to take it easy. We just got to be more careful. I think next run let's not waste so much time. There's a desktop computer in here. Oh, a whole box of nails too. Would have been really good. Still no generator, though. There's not that many zombies around here. I, I guess they must have all been pulled out of the town by, like, the helicopter. and I pulled some up out of the town, like, near the gas station, but not, like... Uh... Not that many. <laughs> Poor Howard. He was just, he was doing so well. More good stuff. God, there's a full barbecue in this box. Yeah, we needed all those nails to uh, secure the uh, secure the base. We had books, and we had we had all sorts of stuff. Oh, there it is. No, I can't get to it, though. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh. More. Oh, God. There's so much stuff. Well, we could have gotten pretty much everything we needed on this run, too, had I not stupidly gotten uh, bitten. Bitten and bleeding. Shouldn't there be some symptoms by now? Yeah, you would have thought so, eh? Good cooking volume one. Already read it. We 
could have taken this TV too. Just gonna have a drink of this juice box. Dowie, we have some terrible news. We're just, uh, we're just, we're waiting for the inevitable right now. Howard got bit in the groin. Sadly, they didn't, they didn't bite my penis right off. They just nibbled a bit of it, and now we're dead. Kill the horde. What if there's a chance that I live, though? Well, I haven't turned yet. Do you think there's a small chance? There's no chance. But what about even just a small chance? Uh, hey, guess what, everybody? <laughs> Default settings are up to 20 minutes to turn. We found a generator as well, um, Dowie, in one of these garages, sadly. Take some vitamins. Might as well use all the guns. I don't think I'm going to be able to get back there in time, though, unfortunately. I had to drive all the way back, get the guns, load them all up. I was too scared to shoot the guns because I didn't want to attract too many zombies, but now it doesn't matter.
God. How on earth? You see this all-star performance and then you wonder, how did one zombie bite my groin? in four hours unfortunately we were really slow from being bitten in the groin and the uh the house alarm holy crap the radius of the noise from the house alarm they were just coming from everywhere right i feel like that was a, a great run and we learned a lot right we, we learned a lot time to reincarnate as a future billionaire farmer Poor Howard Toledo, eh? Poor unfortunate soul. I think we got better at fighting on that run. Uh, except for the... Except for getting bitten in the groin. <laughs> we need to find a, uh, a cup. We need to find a, uh, a, a cup for our groin on the next run through, right? They managed to bite it right off. Or at least uh, they nibbled on it a little. Um, custom sandbox. Next. Rosewood again. Now that we're a little bit more familiar with it. We want uh, survival challenge rules from last time. Start multiplier and peak multiplier. So one is default. So we're playing default zombies. Okay, that's fine. Follow sound distance 100. The distance a zombie will try to walk towards the last sound that it heard. So that house alarm attracted zombies from 100 tiles away everywhere. That's why so many were coming in. Go a thousand, Jesus! No thanks. I, I think a hundred is is enough. Um, what? Um, yeah, we'll just go with this. These are this is the rule set, right? Set that to ten k and watch them all come. No thanks. Okay, let's go. Uh, let's do lumberjack again. That was fun. Um. Max fitness strength. What else did we take? We took short sighted. Um, we took weak stomach. We took prone to illness. We definitely took smoker. 
We took underweight. Faster rate of zombification and more prone to disease. Okay, we'll take these ones and then we can grab Dextrous. Brave. We didn't really need it last time, right? Lucky, Runner, Sower, Fast Learner, Keen Hearing, Handy. We still got 11 points. Okay, let's take Brawler. Um, did we want Cat's Eyes? Baseball player gives us long blunt as well, actually, which is pretty good. Brave, brawler, ama amateur mechanic. We could go, we could take lucky this time. Let's take lucky this time. And then we can grab uh, speed demon as well. For our last one, right? Sunday driver is safe and free points. Isn't it too slow? Sunday driver. Speed demon's probably better, right? We need increased crotch resistance. Howard Toledo got bitten in his dangus. Unbelievable. Organized means you can carry more. Yeah, I think uh, strength lets us carry more as well. But yeah, organized is a pretty good good one. You're right. Organized is... Oh, we want Outdoorsman, though, right? Outdoorsman's kind of a good one. And uh, will will um, help us with uh, prone to illness as well. So we need a, a, a plus two if we want to keep all of these. Or a one, two. Cowardly, clumsy, slow reader. Slow reader doesn't really matter, right? We're playing solo. We can just uh, advance time. We want that for sure, though, right? Speed Demon, Dexterous. I think this is fine. I think we're going to go like this. Um, we hit random once. Parker Kaufman. In a denim shirt, a McCoy's t-shirt, baggy jeans, long socks, and sneakers. He has a beard. And he has a ponytail hair type. Oh, yeah. It's pretty good. And he has the lucky trait as well, yeah. Parker Kaufman. All right. This is our new guy. Do we need a random? Yes. Oh, it's always one random. give this guy three days max let's see let's see depends where we start I guess let's see if we can find something good and once he gets a car he's gonna flip it Ooh, a speed demon It's, uh, it's time to pan. Let us pan. Got Metalwork Volume 1 here. This is... Oh, this is like a kids TV or something all right let's just see if there's anything up here trapping volume one here we go I've got a gun already
All right. Well, we're we're down where we died <laughs> last time. We're very close to where we. It's time to run. Hello. Sure is a lot of noise. Try to lose some of these guys. This is the supermarket. We know where we are. At least we're familiar with uh, Rosewood now, right? Try to get uh, out of town and work our way back through it. We could head to the farmhouse and just sort of regroup a bit there. <laughs> Panicking like crazy here. <laughs> God, that house alarm really has attracted like every damn zombie in the world. <laughs> God, look at them all go. Dude, we have to be at more than 100 tiles away now, right? We have to be. Don't want to get too close to trees. It's the auto shop. Watch this corner actually, just in case. It's very foggy. Oh, it's open. It's a bit hot though at the moment. guys are all still walking into town. Is that because of the noise? There's no way these guys are all seeing me in this fog, right? From this far away. Must be the noise, yeah. Oh, 100 tiles isn't the sound distance, it's how far they'll walk. So, what, uh, so a house alarm, what, uh, what's like the sound radius for that? Like, would these ones have been aggroed by it out here? tail and a lot of them 600 tiles jeez 
Okay, now for my favorite trick. I lose them behind one tree. Where'd he go? They wonder. Who knows? Well, once we break line of sight... So, I've pulled a lot of them into that field. Let's just never go back to that field. If we can help it. And then we should be good, right? I think we'll head to the farmhouse and just recuperate a little bit there. Since it's uh, close by. We kind of just got chased out of town. some smokes now. Parker Hoffman. Check this uh, to see if there's a, a magazine on how to use generators. Imagine the first mailbox you checked was how to use generators, the magazine. You'd be so pleased, wouldn't you, to find that. I know I would be. I know I would just be over the moon. Oh yeah, we probably had... Boba, you're right, we probably do have some new dances. We got the African rainbow, rumba dancing, and salsa. Oh, yes. Incredible. My favorite dance. I love the salsa. Alright, hopefully this place is not burnt down this time. Because it's nice to kind of stage here to get to the gas station, right? Safe. There's never any vehicles here, though, is the, is the only thing. There's not, not ever one vehicle. Craft. What do you think of that? We're starting with the basics. Tell me more. The kind of stuff they teach at kindergarten. You like floors? I like floors. I love floors. I love floors. I think if we can um, not um, make noise in town and uh, attract a lot of them in, it's very doable, isn't it? To sort of take little packs one at a time like we were doing. It was just that house alarm. I think we'll need to be a little bit more cautious of, uh, of alarms now, right? You in here? Upstairs? In the bedroom? 
I'm so, <laughs> so scared. Um, nice. So even though I had, uh... Ooh. Nice. Even though I had, uh, underwear on, I still... <laughs> it wasn't bulletproof underwear, sadly. Oh, man. Here we go. That's great. There's a red electric guitar here as well. A jacket, some swim trunks. a drink and we need something to eat too oh we gotta bulk up a bit too don't we we gotta get rid of this the underweight uh, debuff packaged corn chicken meat patty steak rolling pin Grill, uh, there's some can stuff here, but no can opener yet. in the pasta. actually leave it here right I really don't want to make noise yet there's a dead rat here Let's have a look over here and see if there's anything in here. Put the rat in the bed. Yeah. Um, Howard Toledo died. We're on uh, Parker Kaufman now. It was really unlucky for Howard Toledo. Really unlucky. Just one, it was just a stray, um, groin bite. What can you do? Hammer, there's a pipe wrench here too. There's a big shovel, which actually is uh, a bit better than the frying pan, right? Two shovels and a garden hoe.
What condition is this shovel in? Not great condition. Alright, fine. We don't even know what time it is, nothing. Oh, there's not much out here. Try to get a watch. Try to find some smokes. denim shorts. Alright, well, we now know the time, at least. Don't say Rift to Howard. No. It's very triggering for him. the intersection. A bit thirsty. Um, let's just see how many uh, nasty bitches there are on the way into the gas station. We're soaking wet right now. It's 25 degrees. Alright, let's see if we can get in there and get some smokes. He doesn't have boots, though. We got a hard hat, though. Nice satchel, thanks. I don't really know what's inside it. Nothing. Man, I can't believe we lost Howard. Oh, shit.
is open. No key. I don't see one on the ground either. Any ice creams? Oh. oh, man. Check the back, I guess. Oh, yes. All right. Woodcraft, episode 5. Yes, please. True Dancing, episode 38. Yes, please. Okay, we're a bit thirsty as well. Okay, maps. Magazines and word searches. There's a fresh burrito in there too. I want some smokes. Nice. Yes. I'm drinking this whole orange soda. Mm. Yeah, we uh we managed to get to the gas station pretty quick this time actually. Did I just see somebody? No. I hear someone. There's another duffel bag here. Oh, yeah. Military desert boots. Very good. There's a baseball bat up here, too. You can use that instead of the uh, shovel. Just eat all of this margarine. Oh, there's some mac and cheese up here, too. Um, still no uh, can opener, though, sadly. And an antique TV. Exposure survival at 7.20 at night? What the hell? Fishing. Baseball bat is in uh, great condition, actually. Let's take. Let's use this instead of the um, shovel. Volume 2. 
There's a wrench. Pump. Some empty gas cans. And a whole bunch of supplies down here. There's Mechanics Volume 1. Another Mechanics Volume 1. I'll take these cigarettes. Alright, let's check these other cars. Oh, shit. <laughs> There's a couple of nasty, nasty mamas down there. <laughs> Good lord. It's locked. Yeah, these are all the ones that we uh, pulled behind us. Um, there's not that many. It's a couple of couple of packs. I don't have great combat skills. We're a little bit tired as well. Maybe we can just check this car. Hopefully we don't have to do any fighting and then sleep and make a start clearing stuff tomorrow. No keys. Well, we can go to the... Uh, there's a couple of cars... Parked outside the uh, mechanics place, right? Oh, we got sneaking and light footed. Great. Oh, was the key in the ignition for that? I'll check. Parker Kaufman. Okay, short-sighted is no longer a, um, a problem. Oh yeah. Okay, we got the key. We can fill that up and uh, and use it. I, th I think it's okay. It doesn't look like mega damaged. So it might be alright. Alright. We need some rest. I heard someone. I'm 
paranoid chat. All right. Um, we're slow readers. We're only just tired, not even very tired. Um, just get a little bit of sleep. Okay, we'll have our favorite shows on in a sec, too. There it is. It's a cooking show. Let's wait for some of this weather to clear a bit. The rain's cleared. It's back now, but it... It's foggy too, right? Mechanics Volume 1? Red? Great. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, more woodcraft. Nice. Let's put some of this stuff away that we don't need to carry around with us. Metalwork and trapping. utensils or anything well we do actually we've got a baking tray we got a roasting pan we just don't have any uh do you have to open the mac and cheese no Or do you have to put you gotta put it in a in a pot, right? Do I need to carry ninety-eight cigarettes with me? Yes I do. <laughs> Is that okay? Oh yeah, I don't have a can opener. I have to go find one. Okay, we'll just eat some junk food down here. 
We gotta bulk up anyway, right? Oh, I should get the, a gas can for that little car too, right? We could maybe go for a little drive today. See, uh, see what's happening in town. Looks okay here. Oh. They're guarding my car. We're carrying too much stuff on us right now. Probably because we got this gas can in here, right? So it's another reasonably hot day. It's 20 degrees. Okay, we got the key for this one. Oh, there he goes. We got a friendship bracelet. Will you be my friend? To be fair, we did a lot of reading this morning. We didn't sleep long either, yeah. Good point, good point. Uh, let me try to pull off a couple of these guys and thin that pack out a little bit.
Nah, this isn't the same world. We, we always restart the world. It seems like a bit... Uh, I don't know. Like... I like the idea that there's no other survivors. It's just me. Oops. God, I really, uh, really struggled there. I like to roleplay a hermit, yes. That's exactly it. My hermit roleplay is second to none. That's good, because we want to make it into the uh, mechanic thing as well anyway, right? I'm just slowly pulling them off of this little packs that we cleared out. I mean, there might be some guys back here tomorrow, but we'll see. boots let's wear these jeans as well hopefully it gives us a little bit of um, protection maybe baggy jeans would be better Last one, since he's uh, on his way anyway. Uh, Terry? Butter knife and briefs? Terry, what are you doing? Baseball bat's still in decent condition.
I got a slam down two pops. I think I deserved it. Ever just slam down two pops? Oh, our shows are going to be on in a minute. I guess we could just uh, sit for a minute and start reading um, something else. While we wait. Metal work? Maybe trapping? Oh, man. Okay, let's get a full sleep tonight. It'd be nice. Time to farm. Here we go. We're learning about some farming. We're very tired. I love farming too. Yeah, let's go to sleep. I know it's only seven o'clock at night, but we got sleeping tablets if we need to uh, to reset or whatever. I mean, we got still got power, so we could do a little bit of reading in the morning. Sort ourselves out for food and stuff, too. Um, let's get, um, this stuff, and then make a, I don't know if we can make anything, actually, peaches, on a baking tray, in a roasting pan. This stuff is frozen, so we've got to thaw it out first, right? Um, okay, we can't put the meat patty in as well, so we'll put this back in the freezer. What else can we put in this roast? Eat, add radish. We can't add any pineapple or anything to it. Can't add any mac and cheese to it either. All right, it's a sausage and uh, radish surprise then. favorite. Mm. 
what are roasted radishes like? Oh, probably awful. Like, normal radishes are pretty bad, too. Okay, roasting pan can go back under the sink. The rest of the cooking stuff. Alright, so we need a can opener. And we can watch our shows in the morning before we set out to uh, get that car working. Cooking. All right, six thirty. I'm going to eat this gum, too. I want to have, uh, I want to have some uh, sugary breath for the day ahead. Eating gum. Yeah. I know. What a what a breakfast we had. Roast sausage and radish. And then just washed it down with some like gummy worms and a uh, stick of gum as well. It's pretty good. can oh I think the trunk is maybe not a thing Oh, you gotta unlock it on the dash? Alright. Just put the, the that gas can on the ground. Yeah, the trunk would be useful, right? If you find anything. Okay. The trunk is unlocked now. There's a tarp, a tire pump. Some twang. in case. Let's see what condition all this is in. 43% on the engine. It's not amazing. Alright, let's see if we can find anything in the uh, mechanic shop. Let's see if we can clear out some of these nasty bitches from here too. I wonder if it'd be better to just I know this is ground floor but maybe it's just better to live in here. We could park the car and it's close to the gas station.
Hello. This guy might have a gun on him. He does not. He does have a ranger, ranger pants and stuff, though. Average muffler type heavy duty, performance muffler, spare parts and stuff, performance tire, there's a flashlight here, bunch of tires, lug wrench and mechanics volume 2, that's good, tarp, car battery charger, ooh, that's good. There's a lug wrench, coveralls, ear protectors. It's mostly like paper clips and stuff, isn't it? Hello. Varsity jacket. Nice. There's a couple of bits and pieces, nothing like too exciting. There's some safety goggles, but we need read reading glasses, right, for our short sightedness. All right, good. Well, I mean, we could live in there. We'd have a place to park the uh, car safely and stuff. Lots of room for storage and shit, too. It's got a nice big roof that I could get on, too, yeah. I need to... Make some stairs to get up there, though, right? Or fly up. Yeah, I could. Channel my inner Apex Legends and just just get up there. That makes more sense. Oh. Follow me. There's a lot of them right... Ooh. Wow, gosh. There's a lot more zombies in Rosewood this time around, isn't there? Jenny's table. The bookstore.
There's a courthouse here. This is the police station. Now, there's a fire station here too, right? Where we could get an axe from. I think it's right here, actually. It's quite busy around here. Is this it here? Yep. Quite a few zombies out here, though. This is another little neighborhood. I don't think we've been down here before. Um, this, I think, is the school. Uh, gave up. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> oh, there's a van park there. Okay, that's good to know. Oh, that was close. We damaged the ride a tiny bit. Well, there, there are a fair few zombies in Rosewood, it turns out. <laughs> We're just going to try to uh, attract a bunch of them over this way. So that we can clear out some of the places that we actually want to get to. This is around where we died last time, these houses. It's very busy over here. leads to the prison. Car? Do not fail me out here. Sorry. 
I don't know what this place is. Oh, it's the police station. Sure. Alright, I think maybe the fire station doesn't have as many people outside of it as there was, but it's still pretty busy over here. I don't know how many guys are inside either. This may be a bit of an issue too. Oh my lord. It's very busy over here. We might uh, need to do a, a couple of these and just try to lure them out a little. It's just way too busy over there for me at the present time. This is very close to home as well. All these guys. Actually, I think my car honking has uh, has attracted quite a few of them over here. Okay, let's lead them this way. Let's see if see if we can draw a bunch of them out this way. They'll walk a hundred tiles towards the noise, right? So that should get them clear of the the gas station. <laughs> what a cruise. I mean, we might as well just see what's in these houses while we're here, right? This place doesn't even have a TV. We'll s we'll see if they've got a can opener though. That'd be good. Um, no, no, cooking pot though. There's a mortar and pestle here. Ah, thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's see what's in this one. Ooh. 
mais alta, né? Cooking Volume 1, First Aid Volume 2. Some CDs here too. Ice cream. Suit pants. Sneakers. Formal shirt. Headphones. Good. All right. We got the can opener. It's good. Looked like it was moving for a sec there, didn't it? Looked like it was bouncing. Okay, we're gonna drive back on ourselves and see if a lot of zombies followed us. I don't think they did. One did. That's great. That's one less to worry about. Uh, a couple did. They seem to be moving back around a little now. We were at the farmhouse. Yeah, that's right. We made, we made our way towards the gas station, didn't we? And there's a lot of zombies in this field here, too. This isn't your house. It's mine. <laughs> nice parking. That's how I park in real life as well. A 
Louisville map. Tired. Say it ain't so with Toledo. I know. It is so sadly. Toledo. Toledo down. Just one of those crazy things that happens, you know? One day, you're cruising, you're making some big power moves, you're trying to get to the next level, and then before you know it, boom. Your groin, bitten, recovery, impossible, death, imminent. What can you do? Did I keep watching Slow Horses? No, I didn't actually. I need to get back to it. Thanks for reminding me. I completely forgot about it. Pick up these books. Terry. Sorry, I was sitting funny and one of my ass cheeks has fallen asleep. Alright. Um, category food. Fresh. Put the stuff in there. Got a can opener now. don't know what to do with a mortar and pestle. I'm sure we'll figure it out. Exposure, survival. Fishing again. Six o'clock at night. Trapping volume one. He started reading it. <laughs> just want to look this way, just in case. You never know who <laughs> might wander up. Although we'd hear the glass break downstairs, right? Everything is... Nothing's broken down there just yet. So we'd hear... We'd hear banging and glass breaking. Do I know about the watch alarm? Yeah, I said it. I said it so that I don't miss the uh, the morning shows.
Nice. Time to eat some ice cream for um, breakfast. We'll have a we'll smoke a cigarette for dessert. Mmm. Delicious. He's <laughs> just like you. Okay, you got some more cooking skill. That's good. Way too many hammers. All right, we have to kill stuff. We have to kill zombies and start clearing some some space towards. Oh, it's very very foggy. Let's uh, let's see if there's um. Fucking hell. <laughs> So there's a few guys here. guys just have like uh, incredible fog vision we could just see so well in the fog Your time to shine, Parker. Parker Kaufman. Riverside? One of these days, maybe. I love those stealthy ones, very good. Okay, let's go see if we can save all the pepperoni. Here we go. It's time to rock and roll. Captain's log, start date 523242923 er I've arrived at Pizza World.
It's Operation um, Rescue the Pepperoni. Some dough, fresh, uncooked. We got the tomato paste now. Oh. Nice. Serious. Oh. God, that's close. That was close. That was really close. Excuse me, sir. Step away from my pizza restaurant. Aim your weapon and open doors with E. Yeah, I always find it it's it, like a, a bit clumsy, but it's because I'm doing it wrong. Good grief. That was close, eh? Terry, Terry, stop it, stop it. All right. want to boil up some water and disinfect some rags. All right. Good. Um, what? Um, oh, yeah. There. It's just scratched. Whew. 
That was close. That was real close. Right, we'll keep uh, eating ice cream until we get to uh, our desired weight, right? Get rid of this, uh, this debuff. Can we eat more? No, we're full. You okay, Terry? Just having a little tumble. Um, I don't need all of these in here, but I will take a couple with me, right? Just in case. We're on the road and we need to quickly sterilize a wound. I need a needle as well, right? If I want to do uh, tailoring. And uh, I need one for uh, medical reasons too. Yeah, Mr. Toledo got bitten in the crotch and was unable to recover from said crotch bite. Well... Then, then it, this shit really kicked off big time after that, because we were limping around. A house alarm went off, the whole town aggroed, and uh, then he was consumed. They bit his dingleberries right off. Yeah, it was unbelievable. What a way to go. One minute, there you are, with your dingleberries. The next minute, boom, your dingleberries are gone. You're doing great, Dad! Hey, um, yeah, thanks so much for the 420. Sips, will you be playing Dwarf Fortress Adventure Mode next month? Thanks for all the, hug the hugging laughs. Legend. Thank you so much, yeah. Um, I need to play some Dwarf Fortress. I have not uh, played it yet, but I am looking forward to playing it. Yes. A couple of cars here. Is there anybody in Spiffos? It's locked. Key in the ignition. Sure. Mm, this place is locked. Whoops. There's one one nasty man coming my way. Oh, nice. If we could make our way into the uh, town, get to the bookstore. 
see if they've got the uh, the uh, the magazine for the generators. Uh, let's see if there's some other stuff too. Oh, fuck, there's a lot of them here actually. Freaking out here. Mm, more military boots on this guy. Cleaning up the town. Check this uh, this white truck. Oh, jeepers. All right, there's a couple of them coming. <coughs> Should be able to get them. Whew, lost it a bit there for a minute. forget to check no key in the ignition for this one God, getting an axe is just great, isn't it? Sorry, it has to be done. There's another axe. Let's get this one, too.
yes. Thank you. Okay, good. Um, this, uh, I can't find a key for this one, so that's that, I guess. I've got a backup uh, hand axe. I don't know if you can uh, dual wield. Doesn't look like it. All right, we got some clearing out to do here. This is from our antics before with the car honking the horn all over town. Jesus. That hand axe did not last very long. Is it worth repairing stuff? If I have the uh, the stuff to do it. last boss jeez that was close that should not have been so difficult Gotta sit for a sec. Just gotta catch some, catch a bit of puff. All right. Well, I mean, we've cleared some stuff. We can check these cars. We got the uh, the auto shop. If we want to do some uh, some car stuff. There's a couple of uh, vans here. There's a distillery van. We're tired. Okay. Is that a key on the ground there? Yeah, it looks like it over by the black car. I'll pick it up when we uh, when we come back. We don't really want to fight stuff while we're tired go home and eat and read and do all that stuff watch TV for a bit
We've killed 101 zombies already. The condition of this hand axe is not too bad, actually. One hundred and one zombies. Okay, looks like everything is okay here. What happens if you just eat mac and cheese as it is? Is it like, a, is it, it's in a box, but it's, it's canned. It looks like it's like in a can. Do you have to warm it up or anything? You can't eat raw mac and cheese. We're just, we're only just tired, right? We can finish this book. So to repair this, we need wood glue glue and adhesive tape. Wood glue, glue, and adhesive tape. I don't have any of those things. So we'll have to look around for some of this stuff. going to bed. Oh, you only need one? All right. It's almost TV time. Mm, it's cooking. I love cooking. I don't. All right, let's have a quick smoke. Let's eat some more ice cream. Seventy-six. Let's change our bandage. Oh, we're fine. We're cured. Hoorah! Hoorah! Hoorah!
thread, twine, duct tape. Oh, I've got the duct tape. What was the other thing I needed? Oh, I can just do it with duct tape. Potentially repairs 20%. Chance of success is 100%. Yeah, it did. I can do it again. It's done a little bit. So you need two duct tape every time. So I'm using a... F oh, that's cool. That's, that's, that is really good, actually. Okay, so we can put this in uh, belt left. That's great. Uh, that's so neat. I love that. I love that. I'm washing my clothes. Clothing washed. Right. Um, how do I look at my protection? So we have no hands. We have no groin protection right now. And we have no neck protection either. And our leg protection is really bad. So our clothing, our jeans, there's a hole in the groin. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this is what happened last time. <laughs> Maybe this is... Maybe this is the problem. Fabric, needle, and thread required. Okay. Fabric's not a problem. Needle and thread... Probably not a problem either, right? We need to be ripping clothing, getting... If we rip up all the clothing, we, we should be able to get thread, right? Maybe my fly is down? Could be. Could, could be. try to grab some more thread and stuff i think uh we don't want to we don't want to die the same way we did last time that was awful just awful uh let's take the car and uh just sort of like slow cruise <laughs> all the blood on the car And then at least we don't have to walk back. So we're just uh, trying to work our way into Rosewood and just sort of clearing it out at the same time. I checked these cars. Oh yeah, this parking lot is where we were. I was working on, right? All right, and this way, if we get uh, if we get in trouble, we can always just run back to the car, jump in, and drive away into the sunset. Find some scissors and leather strips for better protection. Leather strips, okay. So what? Can I can I use scissors to like cut up a leather jacket? Is that what you're saying to me? 
and with the leather strips I can uh, I can be better protected I got some thread. I got another bit of thread. Well, we should probably check these cars while we're here too, right? There's a key on the ground there. We'll grab that. Rip clothing, keep scissors, use one of jeans. Is that better? Denim strips. Oh, that's good, right? can fix the hole in our um, in our pants why not just put them on uh, I guess so yeah fuel in that one. No key in there. There's a couple of fun-loving criminals coming at me here. This one's got fuel in it. Louisville? This one's got a lot of fuel in it. Great. Pants. Whoops. What happens if you ram zombies with your car? You kill them, but you damage your car as well. So the leather jacket I can potentially get strips from. And then all the other stuff is just whatever.
Okay, cowboy hat you can't cut up. Sneakers you can't cut up. Oh wait, so with this one, oh. It doesn't consume your scissors. Do, do the scissors have like durability or something? <laughs> Revenge is making all of the zombies pantless. Absolutely. We'll never forget you, Howard Toledo. Never. Leather strips, thread, twine, dirty rags, and ripped sheets. <laughs> Look at all this crap. I didn't bring any food with me, but there's probably some food over here in this guy's house. There's a little kitchen here too, right? Can have a break here. Oh, shit. So it has to be denim shorts or a leather jacket, right? God, this opens up a whole new aspect of the game for me. Maybe we got to work on our tailoring skill. Really pad out our, our big boy pants. You know? You know what I'm saying? Baggy jeans. Tailoring takes forever to train. Well, I don't need to max it out, though. I just want to... Um you know, just do it as I go. This guy's got an axe in him. Another one. Holy crap. This will be our third axe. That's crazy. wanted a little bite to eat. All I wanted was just like a little tiny bite to eat from in there. There's another axe coming. <laughs> We're gonna have a whole collection of axes. We can just peel a couple of these guys off and slowly work our way into here. I probably want to clear 
some of this stuff out anyway. I mean, there's a... That's not an axe, is it? I think he's got some jean shorts on, though. Suit jackets, you can't do anything with. Jacket, pants. Where is this guy's jean shorts? He's definitely wearing jean shorts, is he not? Pants. No, he's not. We've been absolutely robbed in this case. You want Kaufman and Dixie shorts? I need a needle before we can do any, uh, any serious work with the, uh, There we go. Denim shorts. Long denim shorts. Seems pretty clear back here. Ooh, adhesive tape and glue. So that we can um, fix our axes. Yeah, we'll eat this fresh muffin and a burrito. It's night and actually kind of a nice lunch. I would eat that. And sniff the glue. That's a great idea. Why didn't I think of that? Metalworking 3, the Hunter magazine for snare trap. It's kind of nice. We'll take it back with us. It's kind of dangerous to be reading this here, I think. Dash Elite Key. Alright, we, we can come back and um, dismantle some of this stuff if we want to. Tire pump in here. It's open. There's no key in the ignition. All right, let's take this uh, this fancy car um, back as well. Another car. Oh. 
There's a couple of nasty bitches over there by uh, Spiffos. drop some stuff off. Alright, let's put all of our um, repair stuff in here. So we want thread and twine in here too. We're almost back. <laughs> We're almost back to where we were. all this stuff in here too. Uh, we can read this. It'll be six in a minute. We're getting tired too, so maybe let's make some food. We can uh, open some uh, peaches. We can open some soup. Some soup. In our soup, prepare soup. Let's add uh, this. Want we'll to put some tomato paste in there too? Yeah, why not? Can we not put any of this stuff in? Broccoli, cabbage, steak. None of this stuff can go into our um, into our special soup. Oh yeah, we can prepare soup, pot of soup, vegetable soup with tomato paste. Let's get some broccoli in here. Let's get some cabbage in here. Let's put some cheese. Let's get a twist of lemon in here. And how about like a little squirt of lime as well? God damn, that's going to be a soup. That'll be a soup to be uh, proud of, I think. Vegetable and cheese soup with citrus. Oh, fudge. Fashionable. That's just down the road. We could go. I like that we basically just recreated Howard Toledo's existence, but with um, Parker Kaufman instead. We're kind of in the same spot as well, where we have means to get around and stuff. We didn't uh, 
waste a lot of time out in the farmlands and uh, we really just want a generator and a magazine and to clear some of uh, rosewood as well. Hopefully a less exposed groin. Yes, soon. All right, it's almost fully cooked as well. Can you believe it? Can't wait to eat this. It's going to be delicious. stuff. Now that's the stuff. So we need four adhesive tape, or two glue, or two duct tape, or two wood glue. This is one, one of the items. Okay. We'll make sure that we collect some more stuff. Great. All right, while we've got light, we should uh, finish reading uh, whatever it is that we were in the middle of reading. I can't remember. What book were, were we reading? Or have we not even started one? Let me grab one. Cooking Volume 1. Okay. We don't need to read Cooking Volume 1. It's now obsolete. Trapping Volume 1 is done. Oh, it's on the floor already. Whoops. Baggy jeans bloody. Those are my old jeans. Maybe they don't have a hole in the crotch, though. That could be good, right? Can't read First Aid Volume 2. Can't read Metalwork Volume 2. Can't read that. Can read Metalwork Volume 1, which we should do. Okay, we're reasonably safe in here now, I think. We have the early warning system downstairs, just in case. The early warning system, of course, is just uh, if we hear a window smash or somebody knocking on the door. Yeah, the stove's turned off. Let's go to bed. More cooking. Boom, 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 ba dum, boom, ba dum, boom. All right. Mechanics Volume One, red, and on the floor. Good, 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 good. Okay. Um, let's grab this, um, meat patty and defrost it. Did I just level up IRL? Yes, I did. 
Looks like it'd be nice to have some rutabagas lying around that I told you to plant during the farming streams. God, yeah, that's a, a great idea, actually. I would love to have some rutabagas. Just gonna just gonna dethaw this uh, meat patty and see what we can do with it. Dethaw. Thaw. Defrost. It looks like we can't do anything with this meat patty. There's no uh, there's no cooking to be done. What about if we put it in a roast pan in a salt? I guess we need a frying pan, right? Oh shit, where? Didn't I, didn't I begin life with a frying pan? Oh, do you know where it is? I know exactly where it is. Okay, let's put this bad boy um, here. So it's not frozen. We need a tortilla for the base item. Empty frying pan, empty griddle pan, empty roasting pan to craft a roast. Make two bowls of pasta. Make two bowls of stew. Mac and cheese. Oh, you need to have the roasting pan on you, right? To be able to do stuff with it. Okay, so let's put bacon. Let's put some sausage. Let's get some pepperoni in here too. And some broccoli. And let's get some cabbage up in here too. That's going to be bacon, sausage, and vegetable roast pretty good minus 73 hunger hey Artek thanks so much for the five gift subs I appreciate it thank you Alright, hopefully we get rid of the uh, underweight trait, right? We're eating like kings here. Boom. Incredible. Okay, 78. We're so close. Actually, we've gotten rid of it, it looks like. We're out of shape, though, but we're stout, fast learner, brawler, lucky, outdoorsman, dexterous, prone to illness, smoker. Yeah, it looks like we got rid of uh, underweight already. Great. My, my jeans are very ripped up. I'm going to have to put these ones on instead, I think. Con they're in good condition. They're just covered in blood, unfortunately. These ones have a hole in the groin and are in bad condition. All right. I took out the trash. I put my roasting pan back. So if I pick up the saucepan, I can probably do some mac and cheese, right? Okay, we'll drive our other car back uh, today. It's down where it needs to be right now. He's out of shape. Yeah, um, I feel like with enough um, slaying, we'll bulk up in no time, right?
chopping wood gets muscles too. Nice. Okay. Looks like we got a couple of nasty bitches that have moved into town overnight. Oh. One of our axes uh, busted as well. Leather strips, yes. Jeans. I think we got enough uh, denim stuff for now, right? Two hand axes. We'll put the busted ones in the in our duffel bag too. Take them back and repair them. Gaining max fitness takes one in-game year. Okay. Well, Parker Kaufman is going to uh, is is going the distance, so he probably will max out his fitness, no problem. What about his other skills? Axe is getting there. We're almost level four axe now. Long blunt. Nimble, sprinting, light-footed, sneaking. General fitness. I guess we've got to do some exercising. Oops. You know, I feel like we are already are exercising a lot, but... Nobody's biting my crotch this time. Not with my new jeans. No thanks. Shoes, tank top, boxers, briefs, denim shorts. Jeans. And we didn't check this red, uh, this red truck. And there's a wrench. Coming together. Mini skirt, pink frilly underpants. Animal print underpants. There's a varsity jacket. What happens if you. Oh, nothing. Nothing special, anyway. It's locked. I don't see a key on the. Is that a key? Or is it some glasses? No. Holy crap. It's uh, me, Mr. Eagle Eyes Malone. We can get into this uh, car now. It's got uh, no fuel. Oh yeah, Jenny's Jenny's table we went in last time, right? There's um What's this up here? We didn't go up here last time. Maybe it's a pub. There's gotta be a pub somewhere around here, right?
What is that? It, I think it is actually a pub. Holy crap. There's also um, cars back here, too. Plastic bag. Wow, this is a fancy one. Oh, shit. That's a sporty little number, eh? What's up? Nice. Anything? Medical coat? We need a medical coat? Baggy jeans? No, we don't really need any of this stuff, do we? I come from. All right. This this stuff in here is probably still pretty fresh. Another axe. Mm -hmm. I think this guy had some scissors on him. <laughs> oh no. Sorry, I got another one. God. Oh, 
Oh my. <laughs> oh gosh. There's gonna be a lot of zombies coming down here pretty soon. We didn't want to make uh, too much noise in uh, in Rosewood, if you recall. Our exertion levels are a little high. But we need to exercise. If you remember. Oh no! Oh no! No! I think we should not have fought uh, after the alarm went off, right? There was just too many of them. And then the uh, the exhaustion just got on top of us. Ah. Cooking level is too high. Oh, fudge. Run number eight? Yeah, we got killed by the exhaustion. Just could not. I don't know if I got bit in the dick that time. Maybe I did. Oh, okay. Um, we want to go with survival challenge rules this is run number eight really like the lumberjack stuff i'm gonna do it again so we want outdoorsman dexterous let's grab brave and brawler we need uh, short-sighted, slow reader, weak stomach, um, prone to illness, smoker, and underweight, right? And then we want fast learner 
Or do we want lucky and then something else? If we take lucky, we could grab uh, cat's eyes as well, which might be good, right? And then we'll grab speed demon too. You think lucky is a waste? It's like 10% to find uh, good stuff, right? Ten percent of what? It's just a, an extra ten percent chance of finding good stuff. We had lucky last time, and we found like uh, like seven hand axes. I mean, I've done like eight runs, and I hadn't seen any until that run. Lucky combos with scavenger too. Oh, nice. Slow healer and restless sleeper are good. High thirst is an easy six points. Yeah, high thirst is not really a huge issue, right? Just like, you just carry around a lot of water with you. I mean, if you're in a little town, you'll always find water anyway, right? So we have six more points. Should we take fitness? <laughs> yeah, I'm taking fit this time. I'm not being caught out like that. Like, like that. I think I think the plus two fitness at the end of uh, underweight, it'll be really good, right? Keen hearing could be good too, yeah. Ugh. Ugh, just go all out and get strong athletic. Okay, we're going to go like this. Okay, one random. Gerardo Hamlin. Ooh. Gerardo. Gerardo Hamlin. Um, Which run is this? This is uh, run number eight now, isn't it? It's pronounced Gerardo. I know. I know what it, I know how to pronounce my favorite name, Gerardo. Gerardo is a winner. You can feel it. All right. Well, listen, Gerardo. Whether he's a winner or not is uh, going to uh, his story will begin after I've had uh, a little break. I gotta go and um, use the facilities, and uh, I might also just grab uh, a quick bite to eat as well. So I'll be right back, and then we'll uh, and then we'll crack on with Gerardo Hamlin. <laughs> I feel like we've, I feel like uh, like the 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 very beginning of the game we kind of can just about manage now, right? So at least it's practice. <laughs> it's just the, you know, five days in part that. <laughs> Oh, okay, I'll be right back.
Oh, sorry, I'm back. God, it's so cold out today. Jesus Christ. Um, I'm back, and I'm ready for um, run eight. Is it eight? I think it might be run eight. Unbelievable. Good God. Um, I got some tea as well. I brought back some tea. I don't know if you care or not, but if there was a bet, it's a yes. How many groins did I snack on? Every groin. All right, Gerardo Hamlin. Man, we didn't even get to the helicopter event that time. I feel like we 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 accomplished quite a bit in the in five days though, which is something. Is there a card piece mod you can install? I I don't know. Is there is there like a, a sports gym uh, that I can find that has uh, jock straps? Oh shit! Look where we are. The double holster. Okay. Well, we need uh, all this stuff actually. Whoa. Black trunks. Yeah. Wear this. Wear this. Wear these. Oh, yeah. Let's put the black trunks on. Let's get the gold ring on as well. Perfect. All right, here we go. Uh, let's grab those. Oh, some adhesive tape in here. Oh, and some scissors too. We should grab this. No food. Yes. Grab the matches just in case. We don't really need the word search magazine, I don't think. All right. Hello. Anyone in here? Anyone stuck in here? How do, uh, how do, like, key cards and stuff work? Oh, we're in. Like, what's the deal with, uh, with key cards? Like, the, uh, like, locked doors in a building. What's, like, the, the rule? There's, like, a... If you kill a like a bad guy inside the building, they have a chance of dropping a key for like inside that building or something like that. It's something like that, right? Jacket, we've got the jacket, shirt, shoes, some ear protectors, There's another nightstick. Let's get this fanny pack on. Okay. Anyone in the shower? Hello? No. Oh. 
think we need some new pants. These pants are full of holes. Okay, <laughs> it's better. Oh, that's better, actually. What about a uh, jacket? We might need a better jacket, too. This one's in perfect condition. Your protectors, port a disc, another nightstick. I'm doing it. See if there's some wheels out here too. Maybe, we, maybe like since we're here, we should just go to the fire station straight away, get some axes. We've started here before, and it's not uh, it's not so bad, right? It's not uh, impossible to. Um... I've never been into the into the armory though. That there's never uh, I can never find the key. I'm in. <laughs> that was easy. All right. There's a rifle here. Uh, there's a whole, but there's a shotgun. There's pistols. There's another shotgun with a whole bunch of ammo. There's a pistol, an ammo. There's a shells bandolier, and there's a hole punch here. We're really overweight now. We don't have a bag. We do have a fanny pack, though. Seventy-eight shells. Is that enough? There's more in here too if we need them. We can always come back for them. Oh, equip the bandolier. Yeah, good idea with all the shells, right? Gather gunpowder. How do you put these into the bandolier? Where is the bandolier? That's right here. Oh, this just reduces firearm reload time. It doesn't actually... Uh... Store, um, you know... Alright, are we going out the front? I think we're going out the front. Wee 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 There's no uh there's no zombies out here. Maybe now's a perfect chance to get into the fire station. Look, there's a truck out front too. Oh 
Whoops. Do some big peeling here. Just fire a warning shot? Oh my god, man. This has got to be good to wear, right? The firefighter helmet. Military boots is wear as well. Firefighter pants. I feel like firefighter pants will probably uh, protect me from a couple of uh, groin bites. Yeah. These firefighter pants are a little bit, um, Compromised. These firefighter pants are in better condition. All right, so the jacket can go, can go. These firefighter pants can go, and we've got the uh, we've got the bulletproof jacket on as well, right? The bulletproof vest, I should say. We're a little bit thirsty. Some more military boots. You need a watch or something would be good, right? It's locked. Ah. Here we go. Look out. I'm coming in. Need some water. What are these books? Oh, they're just, it is just a book. Just a book. Is anyone actually in here? No? All clear? We need to... Ooh. There's exercise equipment in here. Nice. Oh, hello. What are you doing back here? Uh, that must be coming from upstairs. Some safety goggles and a mop. Fireman pole. Hello? This place is incredible. 
Military boots, shovel, there's some road cones in here. Two axes, a crowbar, oh my god, two more axes? Okay. Oh, look at all of these um, meds and stuff too. Oh man, this is great. This is perfect. Yeah, the fire station seems great. Probably we'll need to secure it a little bit. Dance magazine. There's hip hop number one here. There's a lot of uh, lumberjack shirts. But look at this, we can park um, cars in here. These aren't open, are they? No. No, they're not. It's all closed up tight. There's a saw, a trowel, wood glue, rope, <coughs> wrench. There's a propane tank in here too. Which way does it go? This way? Oh shit. Keep it down. Up here. Anyone in here? No. Some beds? <laughs> Holy shit. This is great. Oh my god, man. Look, at there's a whole kitchen up here. I suppose there would be. Any ice cream? No. Sadly, none. There's granola bars. What's in here? There's some marinara. There's a kitchen knife. Okay, there's a can opener. Oh my god. Perfect. Alright. There's a TV here, too. Just in time for Woodcraft. I love Woodcraft. It's a VHS TV as well. Yeah, I can I can watch my favorite shows. There's a watch on one of the corpses outside. Oh, okay, I'll go. I'll go get it. There's a magazine here. Oh, there's the pole. Oh man, this is this is a great base. It's huge though. I feel like maybe it's gonna be hard to defend. Or is it not too bad? You're doing great, Dad. Whoa. Here we go. We're gonna need some sheets for these. A helmet? Pants, more boots. Ah, oh, this is great. It's surrounded by a tall fence on three sides. Remind me, um, what are the rules for like fences and stuff too? There's, um, it's like zombies don't attack stuff that exists already in the world. Like they'll attack your stuff that you build, but they wouldn't attack offense it's something like that right it's only player built stuff right so the fact that i guess part of the appeal with this place is that because it does have the fence on the outside all you got to do is build at the front and then defend the front that's cool 
All right, we're a bit hungry. Think of all the cars we could park in here. I didn't realize that uh, this place was uh, this this good, but also I didn't realize that it was this empty as well. There's like nobody here. I think you can slide down the fireman's pulley. I don't want to do it while I've got... Wait. Gerardo Hamlin. Oops. Okay, there's a couple of there's a couple of nasty boys out here, but I could probably take them. I could probably take them in a minute. Okay, so the garage door, it's nice because the whole garage area doesn't seem to have um, any window. Oh, there's windows inside the garage, right? But like the rest of this building, we don't really need, right? The garage, and then. Like, even if we just built a wall here... Oh. You see me. Oh, he's gonna come in. So we have to plank this up. Open it. You can't climb up the pole here, right? You can only slide down it, I'm assuming. Oh no. I don't know where they Oh, I see. Ah, oh, I broke in from this side. I guess these guys are all, um, we're going to have to be careful around here. We'll probably have to clear the, uh, the perimeter too, but then they'll, um, we'll probably pull more and more of them too, right? <laughs> Use the shotgun to clear. Well, then we'll be under siege immediately, which we don't really want.
Can you use furniture to block them? Or is it better to just build, like, actual walls and stuff? No bag. They just destroy furniture? Okay. There's an apple in here. I guess we should probably drop off some of this stuff. Um, we got an axe. Just read this one, right? Yeah. Perfect. Screwdriver. We got... It's all these nightsticks that we have, right? We don't need to carry this many around. Good to have a couple as a backup. Louisville has riverfront mansions, which are god-tier bases. Oh, neat. Um, let's make sure that we set our um, watch as well, right? For the morning. Alright. So we'll sleep in there. Seems good. We're a little bored. We have to keep our. Wa we're thirsty this time, so we're gonna have to keep our uh, our water topped up. Is there a way to get onto the roof of the uh, of the fire station? Or I guess you don't really need to because you got the upstairs. Depending where the pole is. Oh, maybe you do want to get onto the roof. Onto. Maybe if we get a sledgehammer, we could just knock this through and then put some uh, rain catchers and then plumb them at the bottom. You can fall through some of the roof panels. Oh. Sledge through the wall and then garden out on it. That's a good idea.
turn the lights on. Doesn't don't lights uh, attract uh, the zombies though, or does it not matter? Is it just if they see you? It is nicer with the lights on. We'll need some sheets for the windows, I guess, right? All right, fine. Let's go to bed. All right, we'll try to catch our shows. Let's turn the alarm off. Let's grab this roasting pan. Oh, we got nothing to roast. It's because all of this stuff. You want to make some uh, some bacon. You want to make a bacon, chicken, pork chop, sausage surprise. Maybe it's a bit wasteful of, on our f wasting all of our food like that. We got so many uh, backup pieces of um, gear too, right? Boots, pants, helmets, everything that we would need. Let's defrost this. Boots and pants and boots and pants. Mmm. I do love boots and pants. So, we can make a roast with bacon, sausage, and some salt. That's all we got. We're going to go find some more food. get this cooked up before the, our shows start hunger boredom and unhappiness nice dance moves do I know? I know Hip Hop 1, Hip Hop 2, Can Can, and The Chicken. You like that? That's good. I didn't get any uh, books or anything, did I? So we're just waiting for this.
Okay, here we go, cooking. Cooking and carpentry. All right, let's uh, let's get outside and start um, clearing around the uh, the fire station and see if we can um, get some uh, more stuff that we need. Right, would be nice. If we put the radio on, there's a certain station that will tell us when the uh, helicopter event is gonna is gonna hit us. That might be a good one. The emergency broadcast uh, one. He's not coming to me. Okay, I don't want to... Uh, I want to keep these boots, but... Maybe if I run around a lot more, we can get um, even more fitness. I need some sheets too, right? Okay, let me put all these spare boots in here. Oh, you can't... Oh, this isn't a radio that you can actually uh, listen to. This is just like a... Like you can deconstruct it or whatever, right? It's a decorative one, yeah. I don't know if you can use the treadmills. I've never... Uh, never tried to, to... I've never even... I don't even think I've seen one before. It's the first time. Can I use my axe through the fence? see no okay interestingly though they do not actually attack the fence so they have to path all the way around it Which is great for us. Oh shit. How can I not see through that? <laughs> it's crazy. Alright, let's start heading up this way. Zombies are smarter than dogs. Really? Put a log fence up behind the fence, then they can't see you either and won't run around to attack. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, because I guess if we're out in, in our yard, they'll always see us from the road, right? Okay, let's see if any of these police cars are, um, well, if there's any back here, and if there are any, we can see if we, here we go, duffel bag, baby.
There's no police cars here. And also, where's my um, duffel bag? Oh, it's here. I just can't, can't see it because it's so dark. That's weird. Perfect. Put these in here too. All right, great. Keys on the floor, I see them. Okay, need some gas. Doesn't seem to be anybody back here. All right, great. Well, we got a bag. We needed one. I mean, the fire station, um, if we're not there especially, will be safe because there's no reason for them to even try to get in, right? in here. Oh, I didn't check to see if the key was in the ignition. No, it's not. What's this, a courthouse? The courthouse seems pretty big. Is it just a big empty building, like the, uh, the two buildings that we've just been in, pretty much? Police station's pretty empty. I don't think there's any gas to take from here. I mean, the gas station is just up the road, but we have to go all the way through the town to get it, right? probably want to put a, a generator up on the roof too right so we're looking for a sledgehammer we, we know where to find sledgehammers anyway right in those uh, garages basically just in these houses behind the fire station Sledgehammers can be incredibly rare. I hope not. I mean, there's other stuff that we need to, to find too, but... Jesus. My fire station.
nice. Yeah, the axe is great. I mean, it helps to have like three skills in it to start with as well with Lumberjack, but yeah, no, it is very good. Locked up. I'm just out there. I, I'm just I'm just out there and I'm 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 making a start. I'm I'm happy with this start actually for once. It's nice to start somewhere a little bit different. Soaked pants. Okay, take these boots. I just feel like if we have loads of extra pairs of boots then We're good, but I mean, there's there's going to be plenty of other pairs of military boots to get, right? can we'll carry around with us there's a revolver here some tape duct tape thread um, let's put all that in there That's better. That's better. We're getting a little bit drowsy. Wear no socks. Am I not wearing any? I got long I have some long socks. God, we're drowsy it's like twelve thirty in the afternoon. <laughs> oh, I missed the shows. I missed the twelve o'clock shows just patty with a roasting pan no a griddle you could do a griddle right no a griddle pan with the meat patty doesn't work what uh, what works with a griddle pan what would you put on a griddle a pork chop a chicken a corn well we could do a stir fry Chicken, corn. Let's put a pork chop in here too and season it up with some salt. Mmm. Empty the griddle pan. Yeah, he has, yeah. Yeah. He's probably, he'll have more though. He's, he's always. 
empty the griddle. Oh, the griddle pan is what's full right now. Okay, I see. And then what? I just chuck it in here? Griddle pan. Oh, no, it's this. Chicken, corn, and pork stir fry. It's on. <laughs> He's humongous. Look at the size of him. What a what a nightmare! This stir fry, chicken, corn, and pork stir fry. I'm surprised. I thought you guys would like this. Gerardo seems to like it quite a bit, actually. Look at that! He loved that. I think that's that's probably one of the greatest things he's ever made. He loved that. <laughs> Terry. Terry is handsome, you're right. Need some books. Wait, was there a book in here? Just a magazine. Oh, and my nightsticks. Well, actually, those can go downstairs. Yeah. I know. Poor Terry. Oh. Thank you. No. Oh no. They're trying to, they've seen me up here. See, that's why I need some sheets. I don't think you can slide down this. Oh. Oh, you got to hold E. No, I'm holding E. That's annoying. I thought you'd be able to. Okay, we got we got company. It looks like some nasty dudes are trying to break into my firehouse. And I'm pretty tired, too. Tell them no soliciting? Tell them something, all right. Where are they? They broke in through the front, didn't they? You in here? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, he's in. You in? is nasty okay we're gonna have to uh, get some sheets right where are you where'd he go where the heck did he go Jesus! We're compromised. How did you guys get in? They didn't. I thought those doors would be stronger than that. Oh no. They're at it again.
our hull integrity. We're in tr we're in a bit of trouble. I killed the brother firefighter. I had to. Gosh, I had to. We're so tired and thirsty. Oh, okay, let's have a quick smoke. Jeez. Is there, um, can I put uh, a new garage door in or nah? It's done. How many holes in the clothing? Good question. It's not too bad, actually. We need some gloves, and I think we need some better pants. I think the pants are in a bad way. Firefighter pants. No, they're in good shape, actually. They're just uh, a bit bloody. Oh yeah, I'm carrying all these nightsticks, which is probably not overly helpful. Oh, I can't believe how exposed we are in here. This is such a cool garage too, but the doors... Well, it just shows the mechanic... Um, the doors in the mechanic would have been the same, right? Maybe we don't uh, make this our base, but maybe we do actually, because we've got so many uh, axes here, right? We really should make this our base. We'll just have to reinforce it. <clears throat> Fill up the truck and hit the road. Um, I don't have the key for the truck. Fortunately. I don't have any um, keys for any trucks. It is nice to have this fence here, though. That is really good. Alright, we're clearing out our own little perimeter here. I have a hammer, so I mean, we could cut down all these trees and start building some walls if we wanted to. Oh, we got all this access to, um, look, there's like a barbecue there. There's a whole bunch of garbage on the ground here. There's a couple of zo zombies over here. I love that. So we have access to these houses uh, back here, which is kind of nice. Yeah, I saw the, uh, the the green contour. So I just started blasting, you know?
please no house alarm. Well, that's a big house. Need some books and stuff. Oh. Is this you? Oh, I think it's coming from upstairs, actually. Oh, yeah, we need sheets. Yeah. All right. No house alone. gonna enjoy some cereal here nice oh there's a pork chop fresh cooked as well don't mind if I do Nice, nice. Some appliances here that we could potentially steal. Some bookcases. Some books up here. What are you doing? Oh my god, man. This guy has a shotgun. And some more police gear as well. There's a gun case here with that looks like a shotgun inside. A double barrel shotgun. keep filling up my water bottle because we are um, we're thirsty what's this electronics magazine do you know what for a minute when I saw that I thought holy crap we've done it we have done it I thought it was the generator magazine it's not though all right some guns to uh, take here but I need to drop some stuff off at home I guess we could come back in here and dismantle a lot of this stuff. <laughs> I like so these, the animations and stuff are great in this. Nasty boys in here? No. Thank God. Well, oh, there's a pipe wrench here. It's good. Um, yeah, let's just uh, d deposit some of this stuff here.
we can uh, take some of this stuff apart after, right? Gas can. Oh, the gas can is uh, probably not helping, right? It weighs a ton. All right, we just gotta be careful every time we come back now because the, the door is wide open. Our shows are gonna be on in a minute. We can watch them. What is it? Cooking. Is it always cooking in the morning? Cooking, is it cooking in the morning and then uh, woodcraft in the afternoon and then uh, at six o'clock it's the survival one? Usually? Nice. Here. I hear you. Are you in my base? You're not invited. This is a private party. Where are you? I need some sheets. It is, it is very unsafe in there, but what can you do, right? I have to go get those guns um, from that other house at some point. Take the curtains from the house? Oh, yeah, I could do that, right? Wait, did the house even have curtains? I'm not even sure. Start prepping a getaway bag for the chopper event? Oh, God, yeah, the chopper. Shit. Yeah. Good plan. We need some wheels. I think if we, for the chopper event, if we just drive out to the middle of nowhere, we can just lead a bunch yeah. of uh, zombies out there, right? And then come back. Somebody quite nasty in there. A real nasty. Right, right. I don't think there's no generator here, but. Oh, there is a, a machete. I see you. Hey, look at this guy's got seventeen dollars on him. Okay. Operation Curtain Removal. I've got a radio, so I can see when the um, when the, when the thing is is going to happen, right? The uh, the event, because it gives you like a day warning, right? Oh no, I don't have a radio. Okay, if I find one, I'll take one. 
one of these houses has to have one, right? Because if we tune into that, then we can see... Oh my god, man. Why? These guys all have gun cases. There's an MSR-788 rifle here. Is that good? This um this gun case is uh too heavy. Is there gloves in here? Oh yeah. Nice. Oh. Spooky. All right, this house is done. There's a gun case in it, actually. Do, do I need the gun case, really? Yeah, I probably will come back and get it. So there's guns in both of those houses. There's hidden drugs under the floor. Nice. Okay, um, machete, sheets, I'll take those with me, cigarettes, gas can, adhesive tape, all this stuff can go in here, soap, walkie-talkie, we'll take it apart after. What else did I have on me? Oh yeah, machete. I can't believe we found a machete. Let's put this in in here for now. Okay, let's get some sheets up on these windows. Just so that, um, you know, if we're in the garage... They're not going to see us from the road. Uh, it's not going to keep them out, but it'll it'll keep them from spotting me, right? I think they spot me from uh, these windows as well, don't they? Up here. Especially if I'm in the kitchen. They can still hear me if I'm making a ruckus? Sure, but... Um, I'm as quiet as a mouse. Is the, uh, is the truth. Can opener. Screwdriver. Lighter magazine.
Okay. 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 Oh. How did they know? How did they know? Can you fuck off? Oh. Thank you. <laughs> he just wanted to give me a couple of cigs? I guess so. You're doing great, Dad! I just want to know what was in that stash. Hey, Rice Price! Thanks so much for the 10. What stash? What stash are we talking about here? In the house. I'm surprised there's no radio down here. There's gotta be one in one of the houses, right? Oh, the floorboards in the house? Okay, I'll go check. I'll go check and see. Rice Price, thank you so much for the, uh, for the 10. I'll go check the stash right now. It's a shame you can't turn this radio on, right? I just want to know when the uh, helicopter event's coming, and then we can just stay in, indoors and read books all day. If, if if we're never outside for it, it won't know to come to us, and then we don't need to worry about it, right? you get here what's the meaning of this you just came in from the wilderness all right ready yourselves get get your bets ready oh shit how did you guys get in here what the hell Howdy, neighbor. It's going to be more guns. Where, where am I looking here? I, I don't see anything. Oh, oh, this is the stash. There's nothing in it. I was looking at it before. I thought he had this. It's just money in a wallet. I thought that was his uh, inventory. See what I mean? Jesus. You're doing great, Dad. You guys God damn it. <laughs> hey, Anonymous. <laughs> Thanks so much. Thanks for the 10. Yeah, sorry about that. Well, oh, they're all over the damn place here. Again, 
Forging, farming, salsa dance magazine? Sure. Oh, meat cleaver is a good one for cooking as well, isn't it? What happened here? You. Oh my god, man. Gosh. You think you you think you clear a place, you come outside, guess what? They're back. Whoa. It is never, you're right, you know, when you're right, you're right, and in this case, you are right, and it is never safe. I like the area that we're in. Um, it seems more manageable than uh, in the last uh, run we did with, uh, with our man, who, if you remember, when we drove down here, it was insane. There was a lot of uh, zombies around, wasn't there? So this is better. We got another sheet. Some books and some food. Yeah, no, the garage door is not open. It is broken. They busted it. They smashed it to bits. Bunch of fresh food. Um, you want to make uh, something with the roasting pan? We can. I'm not sure why. There's no ingredients in range that can use the... Uh, the pan of roasting. Maybe we can do something with the griddle. Nope. Um, I'm at a loss. Let's just eat this cheese. We could drink all this milk too. That'll meet ice. Mm. We gotta put some weight on. Oh, it's not close enough to the fridge? What? Like it's in the thing right next to it.
<laughs> Whoops. Texting and driving, sorry. <laughs> um, we don't really want to stay up that long, I suppose, but we, we could just sit on the ground and read for a bit. We got a new, we got uh, Forging Volume 1, right, that we could start reading through. We're very tired. Let's see if we can at least make it till 6 o'clock, watch our favorite show, and then go to bed. Have I thought about washing my clothes? Yeah, I've thought about it a couple of times, but... Um, drying off my clothes. Okay, we're ridiculously tired now, but we watched the, our show, so at least that's something, right? Let's go to bed. Have I thought about sucking an egg? <laughs> I think about sucking an egg all the time. If I'm not act actively sucking on an egg, I'm thinking about when I'm going to suck my next egg. I love sucking them. I love sucking those eggs. <laughs> Where is it? Forging one, farming volume three. I'll put this at the other books. <laughs> All the other books. Okay, now we can do it. Okay, good. Carrots, yes. Let's get a chicken in here. Some eggplant. And some peas. That's wonderful. What else have we got? Got some salt or anything? Nope. We do have salt, but for whatever reason. Okay, that is a, that's a meal. Two griddle pans. Oh my god. You don't want carrots imagine we found a generator um, before they uh, they turn off the uh, the power we need two right we need one for the gas station and then one for uh, the base if we're if we are actually gonna live here and not burn it down <laughs> don't want to burn it down What do I have on me that weighs so much? I guess it's just everything that's in here, right? Meat cleaver can go in here. Oh, I got a pair of boots here too. What the hell? I should put those downstairs. Oh. All right, cooking. Is there 6 a.m. showers? No, but there's 6 a.m. cooking programs that we've just skilled up by watching.
All right. Are there any big nasty bozos down here? No, it looks clear. All right. Holy shit. Nowhere is safe. You can't even walk out of your own front door nowadays. You can make a salad with a knife and a bowl. Okay. Oh, how did you get over here? What the heck? The propane barbecue there. Oops. Hello? Where are you? Not down here. There's some people out in the front, too. I don't think there's a generator in this garage, but... I mean, we could still try to get into it anyway. The piano. loud <laughs> so loud do you mind I was just trying to do a freezer raid Roasting pan, cooking pot, baking tray, baking pan. Kitchen knife, bowl. Yeah. All right. Oops. Take all this stuff back, I guess. It's, it's all good stuff to have. Good stuff that we need for um, to make some really delicious meals. I love how we have just this access back to our base from, <laughs> from this fence. It's so good. No, oh, pardon me. So much canned food. 
eight thirty a.m. Time to get some sleep. Yeah, we we like we operate at night. We're nighttime operators. Wow, look at all this canned food. Holy shit. Um, and then let's put all these... Um, cookery things here too 11.79 I haven't seen a um, a radio anywhere I've seen TVs, but no radios. We'll keep looking through houses, I guess. God, that is such an unsafe door, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, we have no visibility. We're just... <laughs> just we're just doing a huge prey every time we open it. I almost didn't make it there. There's a magazine over there. I'll go check it out. Nothing in the... F this family has one spatula. That's it. Electronics, volume three. Let's put all this stuff in here. But every time I open um, a window now, how come? Uh, how do we get in there? 
Just smash down the door. Gotta go in like the Kool-Aid man. Do I actually though? I'm in. Empty gas can. Oh, roof lights. Some safety goggles. Propane torch. Metal sheet. Hey, we need a propane torch. There's some more garages and sheds and stuff here too, right? Hmm, there's a vehicle here. Nice. Tailoring volume five. Jesus. Aha. All right, I got it. I got the radio. All right, let's get this thing uh, home. And then at least we'll have a heads up on the... Uh, on the helicopter event, right? <clears throat> when we know it's coming, we can just stay inside. We've got books to read and TV to watch and we can exercise or do whatever. We need to find the emergency frequency. Oh. It might have it. I don't know. We'll see. What does the helicopter do if you're outside? If you're outside and it spots you, it, uh, it will just hover over your location. And uh, it makes so much noise that zombies from far and wide will just start uh, walking towards you, which obviously sucks. Um, equally, if you're in or around you're where you're right sort of based. You might. I miss Tarjif. Your friendly local homeowners association representative. <laughs> Sorry to sigh, but some of neighbors have complained about some of the desiccated corpses you've strewn about your front lawn with. Can't oh. put them there, might. Bang, bang. Carpentry. Got it. Next up, a bookcase. A clever reading lady. Hey, Fabio, thank you so much for the 10. I appreciate it. Also, how are you doing? Thank you. <sighs> oh. Next time, beds. I'll be there. I'll be there for that one for sure. Beds.
Where's he going? Why is he doing this to me? Let him go. Where is he going? He's trying to go like into another room. Oh my god, man. Really? Knox Talk Radio, Kentucky Radio, Hits FM. What's your gun to you, Kentucky? Does this, so we have to find one that, that already has emergency tuned in? You can find it in military radios and inside of emergency vehicles. They have a chance to be tuned into it. Oh, that's cool. Okay. All right. <laughs> yeah. This is going to be a stupendous fruit salad. bit tired uh it's two o'clock in the afternoon of course it is what were we reading mechanics foraging uh, it was foraging wasn't it Have you seen the basements and underground compounds they'll be adding to the game? Yeah, briefly saw those. Yeah, they look really good. There, there's a lot of stuff coming up in uh, in the new uh, the new build. Like it, it's gonna be nuts. How many changes there are? Eh? There, uh, like there's gonna be like farm animals and all sorts. Very tired. Try to just stay awake a little tiny bit longer if possible. All right, so forging one is done. You can put it in the garbage.
And we want to put all this fresh uh, food away too. Forgot about this. And there's some canned peas and stuff here too. Okay, it's 8.30 and we're ridiculously tired. And we're hungry too. What can we make for ourselves? Nothing. We have to... It doesn't take uh, the stuff from out of here, right? So we need like a, a bowl. Grab one bowl. And then it'll do it. Bacon strips. Oatmeal. We can make a salad. We can make a stir fry. I don't think we have time for a stir fry. Salt? What about a fresh tomato? Wow, we managed to stay up until 9 o'clock. I'm so proud of myself. I'm such a big boy. Okay, I'm going to go to bed. Such a, just such a big, brave, and strong boy as well. Ah, look at this. 6.10 on the dot. Didn't put my alarm on. We just woke up. Now, I love a BLT. I love a BLT. Take a shower? No way, man. I'm not taking a shower. Never. All right, so we don't have um, the emergency uh, radio, but if we found like an ambulance or something like that, maybe. Okay. I hear someone. I hear like some pitter patter raindrops. Oh, maybe it's just Terry actually. Did you? Could you guys hear that? There's no window there. Oi, mate. That's yeah. my home, mate. Those are my things. Nye put that back, mate. And that. No, no. Stop. Put that back. <laughs> I'm CEU's, mate. Don't make me call the Rosas, mate. Coos oi, wheel. Don't want to call those peaks, but push comes to shove, mate. Oi, Fabio. Um, thank you so much, Fabio. I appreciate it. That's a lot of mate. I get it though, mate. I get it. It was it was English. I think it's meant to be Australian. Or maybe uh maybe it's like uh Brummy. <laughs> maybe. How's our um how's our axe doing? Oh, it's fine. God, it's still in great condition. 7.20 in the morning? Ooh. God. Every time.
check my clothes for holes. No, I think it's fine. It's about it's about what it was. What's the plan for Gerardo? Just to survive. Just to thrive and survive. Same as any other tune. <laughs> Same as any other character. <coughs> We haven't completely cleared out these houses, but we kind of cleared out these houses, right? A bit risky. We checked that one anyway. I hear someone in here. Oh, Jesus Christ, man. The vision sometimes, eh? What the hell? <laughs> God. Carpentry Volume 1. I don't think we need it, though. Metalwork 5? There's a couple of bad guys here. <sighs> Why am I like immediately overweight? Like the minute I I put one thing in my inventory, like I, I guess I don't need all these hammers and shit that I've got. Fourteen point six one. Oh, it's the fireman's outfit. It's heavy. Check the mailbox just in case. Holy shit. Hello. What are you guys all doing here? There's a lot of them there. I think somebody's in here, but... <clears throat> Just want some books. Premium Technologies Radio? No radio here.
bit risky. Whew. I didn't like that. I didn't like walking through the, the forest. That was spooky. I love this base. I just uh, would feel a lot better if it was a little more secure. Just a little tiny bit more secure. It's very spacious, which is nice. I like, I like how spacious it is. That's great. Got a lot of food. Lots of food, holy crap. So much food. Man, we just ate all that ice cream. Good. All right, let me put some of this stuff that we don't need. Down. Like, if I need the hammer or screwdriver or whatever, I'll just take it, right? There's no point in walking around with this stuff because it's just weighing me down when I could be picking up way more. When I'm out on the road. can opener I'll take just in case I need to eat something like while I'm out bandages tweezers some sheets scissors pretty good sewing kit though yeah maybe sewing kit as well I mean it's not that heavy right take this stuff lighter garbage bag all right I think we've almost got enough to do um some rain collectors I need a sledgehammer would be really good Let's go to the police station. Maybe there's a radio in there that's got the emergency services. We'll kill a couple of these guys too since they're so close. Take that. Did I check the fire pickup? Yeah, there's no... I can smash the window and uh, see if there's a, a key in there. We have a bit of gas. Our pickup's pretty good. The fireman's outfit makes you sweat a lot. Yeah, I, no, I, I can tell. Yeah, I'm sweating like crazy here. We're losing uh, losing weight as well. Probably from all the, probably sweating it off.
We haven't checked uh, back here behind the police station for cars and stuff in this fenced area. No, there's nothing back here. We look back here from the other side. There's just nothing there, I don't think. You can't use any of this stuff, right? I'll just see if there's... um radio or something in here. No, it doesn't look like it. There is a micro wave, but no like walkie talkie or anything. I don't think there is any police um, vehicles here. I checked all the desks. Yeah, the armory is just weapons and stuff. I didn't see any, like, there were no radios or anything. Same with the uh, lockers. I'm pretty sure I checked all of them. It is f yeah, I checked some of these, didn't I? I did check some of these courthouse um, vehicles. Should we just break into the uh, to the uh, the the fire car outside the uh, fire station? See if we can find the frequency. Can you use the exercise uh, machines? Don't set the car alarm off. I'm gonna try not to. It's we're okay to smash the uh, passenger side window, right? It's the driver side window that we don't want. What the heck was that? How do you look at the radio? There's nothing here. Oh, in the in V. Whoa. Hello? Boodly doo. Doodly doo. That woke you up. Sorry about that. I think uh, I think my internet is um, is pooping a little. It's having a little poop. Ninety five point eight. Eighty-three percent. Oh, you need.
need a battery for this. Okay, so we just gotta wait for a uh, automated broadcast system. There we go. Average temperature is 25.9. Mild wind from the north. Oh yeah, this can g give us uh, weather warnings and stuff too, right? All right, good. Well, I don't think the chopper is coming today, or tomorrow at least. We'll know about it once it starts, uh, it'll start saying. Make a bowl of oatmeal. Um, oh, this the saucepan needs uh, water, right? In it. <laughs> Make a bowl of sucked eggs. Mm. Now you're talking. Oh no, it doesn't even. I don't know, man. Pour into, pour on the ground. Have all the food next to the other stuff. What, like in this one, you mean? It makes sense, doesn't it? Does it matter? Oh, it needs to be in the highlighting distance. Oh, we have lots of corned beef. Maybe too much corned beef, if such a thing is possible, even. All right, so if I grab this now, and I go into, oh, there we go. Now we can make a meat patty. We can open up some canned carrots and stuff we want to. Place ingredients in roasting. We can prepare a stir fry. You want to make a, a nice stir fry? Bacon. Let's get some chicken in here. Put some margarine in. Oh, let's get some oysters in here, too. Oh, crap. Some corn. <coughs> what about some nice fresh peas? And some salt, of course. Oh, God, this is going to be fantastic. Lost you at the margarine. It'll give it. Uh, it'll give it uh, some more. Um, some more kick.
great. 68 and dropping. <coughs> We're fit. We could be more fit though, right? We have high thirst as well. <laughs> Very thirsty. Turn the radio off. Oh yeah, to not waste the battery. Good idea. We just want to turn it on pretty much every morning, right? To, to get a heads up. Nice. Hmm. What book are we reading next? Or should we read the electronics magazine? Carpentry volume one, I don't think we need to read it, right? Carpentry, it's obsolete now. No, it's still good. Okay, fine. We'll read it then. Where's that magazine? Where is it? Oh, it's here. What's been the longest run? Foraging. Um, I can't remember who lived the longest. Probably um, Howard Toledo, right? What, 17 days? Must have been. Did Brent make it to 20? I'm not sure. Did he? Oh, you slept too long. How could you do this? Oh, I should have set my alarm. Oh. Okay, um, this is red. Carpentry volume one, not quite. Try to make it to a year. Okay, I'll try. Light fog. Okay. Light fog. You hear that? You got that? You heard that? I'm not going out in that. Alright, griddle pan. It's got a screwdriver here that we don't need either. You gotta wait for eight? What, 8 a.m.? Oh, to turn for the radio? Is that when they, uh, when they announce when the choppers come in? Dance until then right now actually let's do the um hip-hop one light fog Oozed. okay no um no helicopter event uh today 
Or tomorrow, I guess, right? Is it what it means? Did it just make two oatmeals? You know what? I'm going to eat them both. Oh, do you have to do you not have to cook um oatmeal? Fine. It's just fresh. <laughs> Dancing during the emergency broadcast is pretty badass. I will admit that of uh, myself, yeah. I I do enjoy that. It makes me feel like a real Billy badass. And if there's one thing in this world that I love, it's feeling like a big Billy badass. Um, it's 8.50 in the morning. It looks dark because it's meant to be foggy. It is not foggy. All right. Well, we don't have to worry about the uh, the Helma Chopper today, at least. So that means that we're free to um, poke around in our neighbor's houses and see if they have any cool stuff for us. How do you keep getting up here? How is it that you're doing it? Okay, I just have to uh, murder my neighbors as well because they keep sneaking onto my lawn. Walking through the forest again? No, 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 no. Not this time. I was desperate for a shortcut that last time, but this time I'm taking the safe way. Some folding chairs and a TV. Well, check mailboxes for these uh, magazines as well. You never know. Somebody might have had a, a delivery of how to use a generator magazine. It was all a dream. I used to read how to use a generator magazine. Check for some smokes as well. Let's see, there's a crossword magazine in that one. Good. We're probably going to cripple ourselves doing this. We're slowly dying, trying to carry this thing. Hmm. 
We might need to get a car, yeah. I'll leave it here so I can remember where it is. It's fine out there, right? Whoa! You cannot be serious. What a guy, man. Holy jeez. Anything in here? Oh, there's glue in here. Alright. We'll carry on having a look around. See if we can get see if we can get a car It'd be nice to get a car there's not many cars parked uh, around here and then we can come back and pick up our generator and carry on looking for this uh, magazine too there's engineer volume 2 Whoops. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Shake, shake the room. Just smash the window? Oh, come on. It's more fun to smash the big garage door. How how often do you get to say, I just smashed up a whole garage door today? The answer is never. Uh, we haven't read this one either. Some cool recipes. The heck was that noise? Fine, I did it your way this time. Ooh. Some fishing gear. So basically my plan is to... Uh, fill up a bunch of those gas cans uh, so that we have just a supply of, of gas for our generator would be good, right? Two fishing rods? Yeah, I know. We're going to really go for it. I can't wait. Whoops. It's the Punisher. He's coming to get me. I'm no match for the Punisher. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, he's there, isn't he? Or is he here? Is he one of these? Where are you? He's got to be in here, right? Oh, there's a safe house here. <laughs> this guy's trying to get in and we people trying to um, get out as well, right? Ooh. 
God, it's nice and quiet for now. What is this place? There's some cars here. What is this? Some small houses? School? Ooh. There's a car battery in there. I'm taking out um, Super Nintendo Chalmers and also Dolores, the receptionist, and uh, Mr. Pennywhacker, the maths teacher. They're all dead. Nice. Took his clip on bow tie. So, car battery type standard. Very good. Locked. This one's not, though. Um, there's a premium technologies walkie talkie. Sure. Battery. No key, though. No key in the ignition either. You made a base in the fire station once? Nice. Did it was it fun? Did you have the time of your life? A lot of books here. First aid volume two, trapping volume three. Standard models, farming magazine, mechanics, volume three. I can't remember if we have first day volume two or not. Oh, this is a small room. Sports shorts, jeans and pants. Okay, I gotta fill up my bottle. Water's still on. I'm just going to drink this milk alone in the bathroom. And, uh, and smoke as well. All right, sadly, those cars are no good. We can't do... Whoa! Hello? <laughs> what the hell? There's, <laughs> she's got some long gloves. I think the leather gloves are probably better, though, right? Oh, this is a church. This is the church. I know where we are. Means that the bookstore and stuff is just up here, but I don't know if there'll be any vehicles. There's the corner store that might have the generator manual in it. God will protect me? I hope so. Yes, deputy? All right, let's check. Uh, let's check Zippy Market to see if the generator magazine's there. God, it's really—it's quite clear up here. Actually, it's not too bad. Whoops. He was hiding.
Jesus. Newspaper. Comic book. Magazine. Any smokes? No? What the hell? Alright, we're pretty tired. We should uh, think about heading back. No magazine. There's the bank. Yeah, I got a whole carton of eggs for myself to suck on. I'm going to go back to my uh, my cool fire station base and just fucking suck on half a dozen eggs. I really can't wait. That sounds like a good. T that sounds like a great time. That sounds like the. That sounds like the kind of time every young man dreams of. Am I gonna cook it or just suck on the shell? I'm just gonna suck on the shell. God, I can't wait. Can't wait to wrap my lips around one of those bad boys. Alright, the uh, the residential neighborhood, we haven't really been to anywhere else, right? Because we've just, uh, we started in the police station, made our way down to the fire station, and have just been sort of clearing in and around here the entire time. So we don't know what the state of play is up at the gas station or anything. We did find a generator as well. I know where it is. We just need a car to go pick it up. drop off some of these books and stuff here too. Yes. We can well we can eventually make our own um, shelves and bookcases and stuff, right? After we find like the magazines and the recipes. That's great. I got a huge collection of gas cans now. I love that you can place stuff. It's nice, isn't it? Um, 
put all this stuff in here. All this really important stuff that we definitely will need. Well, we've got nails, so we can actually start reinforcing stuff. Or make, maybe even making a wall there. Would be good. We want to watch TV at 6 o'clock. And we want to listen to the radio tomorrow morning at 8, 8 a.m., right? Which is no problem. so tired all right um, let's read this first you can read good cooking magazine Lane's auto manual for standard models. The farming magazine. So give us a recipe for a cure for mildew. Oh, God, I thought I saw something there. I almost shit my pants. I don't think anything's really going to wander up here now that we've got all the blinds up and stuff. Unless I'm being chased back home. Then it could happen. Exposure survival? Wooden cage trap. Oh, trapping. I haven't done any trapping. For trapping to work, it, it, your traps need to be set up quite far away from the base, right? It's like 75 tiles or something. Seventy. All right. Oh, yes. I love this. What was in this last one again? An empty... A, wow. Come to Papa. Got our own little laundry room down here, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. Check out the Shim Sham. That's a great one. All right, I better go to bed. I want to make sure that we wake up in time for the morning cartoons, right? What are we making? 
bowl beans. One bowl of beans coming right up. <laughs> My level cuisine. Heck yeah. Delicious. We got some eggs now. Do I do I do I have a frying pan? No, I got griddle pans. I don't have a frying pan. Okay, well I have to be on the lookout for a uh, a frying pan. Oh, griddle's the same. So we could make some eggs. I think it'll be cooking at six, right? The cook it'll be the cooking show if it's still on. Yeah, it's cooking again. All right, let's do some uh, reading until just before 8, and then we can go turn the radio on. It's got to be helicopter soon, right? It's got to be soon. Okay, five or zero two. Was was no. Clear skies, light fog. Tomorrow, average temperature is twenty four. Clear skies, light fog. Are we good? No helicopter tomorrow either? Nice. That's great. I'm bringing an empty bowl with me. Light fog my ass. Look how foggy it is out here. That's crazy. Hey, uh, Swacker19, thanks so much for the 10 gift subs. I appreciate it. Thank you. Wowzers. Thank you very much. Um, how are our clothes looking? Protection? The pants? Our pantal protection? Uh... 
It looks fine. Jacket is in good condition as well. Boots. Yeah, they're in great condition. Bulletproof vest. It's seen better days. Tank top dirty soaked. And my duffel bag. And my fanny packs. And my belly button ring silver. God, I'm wearing a lot of stuff. Oh my god, I can't see anything out here. It's so dark. Well, it's not dark. It's just there's no visibility because of um, maybe we go back into town and try to hit that bookstore. See if we can find the uh, the generator magazine. I'll do that and then uh, I got to go. Should only take a minute. It's pretty clear through the uh, through the little neighborhood, right? We've actually got a pretty clear path right to the uh, the main street. Is anybody else worried by how um, quiet it is? I'm just waiting for the chopper to like surprise us. We're actually in like such a good spot if the chopper does come because we could just dart into a house and just hide in the bathroom. Whoa. <laughs> Where are they going? They're traveling quite fast, too. It is foggy. You can like feel the heat, eh? It's so sweaty. Well, the fog's got to clear in a sec. I can't stay like this forever. All right. Zippy Market did not have the magazine that we were looking for. Haircuts and more. Don't know what the more is. A bit worried to find out. All right, the bookstore is just here. See if it's open. It's pretty quiet. Yeah, that's open. Oh my god. I didn't even know what to grab. There's a dance magazine there. don't uh, need to grab all the books and stuff because we can always come back for them we're just looking for uh the herbalist 
Metalwork. Hunter. Lane's auto is pretty good too. Fishing. Nope. 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 This side? Electrician volume one. Nope. There's a there's one here too. Been checked. Nope. No, I don't think it's here. Closed. We don't need to be in here. They might have a kitchen in there, but Blech. I'll go to the zippy market, eat some junk food, get a drink. Ah, the fog's cleared. Nice. There's no smokes here. some plonkies. Alright. I ate the plonkies. That's a shame. Uh, there's still uh, hope, though. There is still the uh, gas station, the magazine rack at the gas station. There's also the school, which we've never been to before. I feel like this run has been... Uh, been a bit of a different one for us too because we started at the police station which we've started at before but this time we um we've colonized the fire station which we've never done before so we're kind of uh instead of the other side of town where we would normally be trying to clear out the gas station and live there and stuff we've just decided to live in the fire station which is very spacious it's it's roomy I mean, there's all these houses, too. Sometimes they have books and magazines. Just have a quick look while we're here. <laughs> Imagine. Oh, this place is a mess, eh? No, I don't think you can take a garage door from somewhere. I'm summoning the groin chomper. I'm jinxing myself. I'm 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 sacrificing myself to this run's groin eater. Look at my my perfect perfectly safe route. Why are you here? Why are you here? How did you get here even? You walk all the way from the road just to come to the back of the fence? Did you see me leave or something? Like I'm I'm talking to uh what was once an undead and now fully dead. I'm still talking to them. Hi, right, chat. The 
water's still on. You shit the bed. Why do you think I feel? I shit the bed all the time. Anyone thinking about dips? I hope, I hope not. I really hope not. Okay, um... We'll uh, we'll leave it there. I gotta go. Sorry, it's uh, it's late and it's uh, it's time for me to go. Um, good uh, good gaming today. Um, <laughs> the, believe it or not, we played three characters today. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Good gaming, yeah. Good gaming. Um, we're. Uh, we're we're on it though. This one this one I think some good stuff's happening. We just need to get some wheels. We just need to get some fuel secured. We found a generator. We got to go pick it up with uh, some wheels. I feel like we could get some uh, rain collectors and stuff. I think <coughs> eighth time could be the charm. Yeah. Listen, uh, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. I appreciate all the uh, support as well. Thanks for the subs, the resubs. Uh, the supers, the gifted subs, <coughs> the donations, everything. Thank you very much. Um, I'll try to be on over the weekend. Uh, failing that, I will for sure be back Monday. But uh, there's there's a pretty good chance I'll be on over the weekend. So we can do some more, more Project Zomboid then, yes. All right, chat. Thanks so much. Um, take it easy. Have a good one. LOL, lots of love. And I'll see you soon. Peace. Bye now. Bye.